As Malaska golf instructors, we are here to try and simplify and uncomplicate the game as much as we can. Unfortunately, there's a lot of misconceptions out there that's actually hurting people's games and not making them better. One of those big misconceptions is what are you actually trying to do when you hit the ball? What hits the ball? Is it your body? Is it your hands and arms? What controls the club? Well, here it is right here. You have a golf ball and you have a club face. This ball only knows what the club is telling it to do at impact. So it doesn't know where your swing is at the top or if you have your body through or if you've shifted your weight back or forth. All it knows is what it's telling it to do when it runs into it. Now it fits in your hand just like this. So if I want to make the ball go to the left, I have to feel in my hands what I have to do to turn the club face over and hit the ball to the left. If I want to hit it to the right, I make the ball or make the face run into the ball to where the face is aimed to the right. If I want to hit it lower, I'm going to take loft off of the club. If I want to hit it higher, I'm going to add loft. Now here's my golf grip. I stick my thumb out, I put my right hand on there. That's my grip. This is what I want to feel in my hands every time I get up over the ball. The more you're able to control the direction that the ball goes, the more consistent you're going to be with your game. If you stand up over a ball and you know you want to hit it to the left and you can feel in your hands what you have to do to make the club face turn over and hit it to the left, you're going to be more confident in your game and ultimately you're going to shoot lower scores.